Hi, welcome to Kairos House. Today we're going to be looking at how I can turn this into the new Yolio R9 Aerodisc. Hi everyone, welcome to Kairos House. Today we've got the first part of a little series I'm going to do where I'm going to go through what I'm going to have to do to change from the Yolio R6 Aero disc or my version of it to the Yolio R9 Aero disc. Now um, I saw this come out a few months ago. Um, if you've been following my channel, you know I don't like cables. And the R9 is a complete internal cable bike. It also comes with the integrated stem handlebar. Um, so what am I going to have to do to change this into an R9? Well, um, I can keep the majority of the stuff. What I will have to change is a uh, bottom bracket, because at the moment we've got a um, BSA thread. Uh, what have I got in there? I think I've got a dual race bottom bracket. Um, I'm going to have to get a BB86 press fit for the R9. Um, I've had a look online, I can get some wheels manufacturing um, press fit threaded ones, so they lock together. Um, I chose the BSA version of this in the first place because it threads in rather than presses in. I had a lot of problems with my BB30 press fit creaking, um, but with the BB86 threaded, uh, the threaded version rather, it's still a press fit but with threaded cups, and they thread into each other, so that kind of locks it in. I shouldn't get any creaking with those. Um, um, I probably changed the 140 rotor to a 160, just because it's always nice to have extra brake. I haven't found I've needed any extra, but um, yeah, it's nice to to uh, to have some extra brake when you need it. I can keep the wheels, although I will be changing. Uh, inner tubes and tyres. I think I'm going to go for the uh, GP5000s with a latex inner tube just to try it out. I've always wanted to try out latex inner tube so um, we'll try that. Also I'm going to have to get um, some valve extenders because the latex inner tubes I'm looking at only have a 51mm valve. These are 60mm rims so I'll need some extenders there. Um, let's have a look. I can keep the brake calipers because it's direct mount. Obviously I'll need to turn uh, this bit around for 160. Um, I'll get new hydraulic brake cables. Sorry to zoom you around. I'll get some new hydraulic brake cables uh, just because. Uh, DI2 can stay the same because it's all internal. Um, looking around, I can keep the uh, bottle cages, the crank, the dralia, pedals. I can keep this uh, cassette. Uh, obviously, I'll get a new chain. Um, let's see. Uh, I think looking around, I can keep the, uh, I can keep those, the shifters. Handlebars are left to go, stem are left to go, computer mount are left to go, frame are left to go. But apart from that, I'm thinking, so I just need a bottom bracket, a new front rotor, hydraulic cables, tyres in the tube, and that's about it, I think. Uh, yep, I might treat myself to some new brake pads, but the uh, ceramic ones in there seem to be holding up. Um, that is about it for this first part. Um, yeah, so what I'll do, um, order the frame and then I'll put my frame, handlebars, stem, probably the front rotor. Um, I might even put the bottom bracket shell on eBay or something, sell that off, see if anyone's interested. Um, if anyone's interested watching the video about buying a frame uh, S-Works Venge head, uh, stem 
and handlebars, um, just let me know. Um, I can give you all the measurements of how long this steerer tube is because it's cut right down at the moment. Um, it's pretty short. So, oops, as the bike moves and probably falls over. Um, yeah, so that's um, it for the first part um, uh, of what I'm thinking. And uh, so as we gain momentum into what we're doing, I'll just make a new part each time, keep you updated as to what I'm doing uh, in between my other videos. And um, cool, that's about it for this uh, edition of Kairos House. Thanks very much for tuning in. Like, subscribe. If it, as I say, if anyone's interested in the frame, um, it's not being crashed, it's not being scratched. Um, I'll take good care of it. Um, just let me know. Um, if not, I'll uh, be sticking it on eBay when my new one turns up in a few months uh, when I order it eventually. Cool. Take care. See you on the next Kairos house. Bye.